so friends welcome i hope you're getting some value out of my videos that i'm uploading on youtube very shortly within a week i shall be launching my own website make it note of it banktechskills.com wherein you will be having these ppts in details various processes of finical plus live videos of finical working on these clearing zones various transactions account opening loans liabilities assets rtgs neft all the transactions loans vehicle loans education loan home loan running overdraft cash credit how to link collaterals how to lodge a collateral various videos i shall be uploading on my website so this is just a precursor of things that i'm trying to show it to you so i hope you'll be getting some value addition from these videos that i'm uploading on your youtube kindly subscribe to it share it with your friends and colleagues so that they gain certain amount of knowledge so that they, they can work like a real king in the branches of the bank or those who are joining thinking of joining the bank as a career so these fundamentals will be of immense use either they are working in private banks mnc's banks or government sector banks so finical is the system which is most predominantly used in most of the banks so in this presentation video i shall be showing you what jargons are used for opening of zones inward clearing zones here what is the process then videos i shall be uploading on my website so i am again repeating wherein you will get a total hand holding from me all your queries shall be answered so kindly subscribe and like the youtube so that a lot of people are benefited through it share it with your friends and colleagues so this is a very small endeavor from me to empower you as a real tiger bankers in your domain so that you can work with more confidence and more energy levels so that you can succeed in your life personally and professionally so this is the menu option we open a zone today i shall be discussing how to open a inward clearing zone so i have been requesting in each and every video please buy a small diary a big diary as per your convenience keep on making these notes right so you can categorize your diary into various clearing zones transactions account opening loans deposits flexi ffd rtgs neft various transactions cash deposit cash withdrawals cash um, transfer entries how to do it hxfer so you can divide your diaries accordingly right so uh, before taking much of your time i'll start with the processes here so this is how you open hmicz is the command so every day a zone has to be open inward clearing checks means checks given by our customers to various other customers of other banks which are presented to us for clearing for that we have to ensure there is sufficient balance and signature tally and the tenor of the check is fine of course we have cts check truncation system through which only image is sent to the drawy bank so we'll be getting only the image and we'll be verifying the signatures so what are the processes and steps so this is a basic concept and knowledge before i show you a real video so hmicz type in the finical system the zone code will already created by the data center a zone which completes a full cycle from opening to closing for given date will not be available for operations for the same date any more only inquiries will be possible for that zone but those who are working in the back offices of clearing it will it won't be the case they'll be getting a zone every day here so hmicz click on go system displays a criteria criteria in between i am also uploading real live videos of finical to show you what you shall be getting on the website itself so that will make more clearer concept into your mind so that you can work with more confidence then so this shall be the menu option the screenshot will be there right 
ओपन द जोन जोन कोड तो डेटा सेंटर ऑलवेज हैज अ जोन कोड क्रिएटेड फॉर ईच एंड एवरी ब्रांच और इफ इट इज वर्किंग इन ब्रांचेस एंड इफ इट इज एट द बैक सेंटर बैक ऑफिसेस इट विल बी क्रिएटेड फॉर दैट बैक ऑफिसेस क्लिक ऑन गो यू गेट दिस ओपन जोन राइट so this is the zone code will be allotted by the data center every day because invert will be shall be be doing be, shall be done at the branches every day except holidays and sundays right and gazetted holidays or whatever days are declared in ni act negotiable instrument act now invert first you have to when you open the zone you have to enter how many instruments total we have received and what is the total amount so that after en entering each and every instrument in case we miss out or we add extra check there will be a unbalancing so we have to verify and find out which check has not been entered in the system or which check has been entered with the higher amount than the actual amounts that's why the amount is increasing that the amount we received so we have to enter the amount number of checks instruments and number of amount in advice then we click on submit the zone is opened successfully the inward we have to enter the number of instruments of all the banks and total inward clearing received from different banks to our bank oblique branch as per the working in the respective banks right so we can inquire hmicz i inquiries also there we can inquire also so this screen appears here you can see here right hand side you can see here total number of instruments advices kitne aaye hain i have written here three here itself since we are doing a demo here just three here and total amount is 2 lakh right don't have to enter anything here just click on submit accounting statics tab note entries have been created by the system into respective office accounts also so this is how it is done here so right okay the three instruments 2 lakhs 2 lakhs is here this is screenshots i have shared with all of you click on transaction tab note the number of transactions have been created also right so we can really say if we have received let's say 50 checks so 50 transactions have been created in the system or not if in case if it is less or higher we need to find the difference here right so this is how we maintain inward clearing zone right right so this is accounting statistics instrument statistics and transactions statistics so since this is a training server no records were fetched it says says so just i am sharing you various fields which are to be entered in the system which are always created by the system itself right so here you can see click on transaction tab note the number of transactions have been created right so we have to verify the number of instruments and number of transactions are telling or not otherwise we have to find the locate the difference right and we have to tally the clearing account also so this is how we do it now friends this is the command for entering instruments lodging instruments checks received which belong to our bank of our customers manually in the zone the command is h i c t m o inward clearing transaction maintenance right so this is how this is done h i c t m o h m i c z we open the zone we enter the number of instruments and total amount in advice received from all the branches total all the branches of all the banks right remember this not a single bank or single branch but total inward clearing instruments and total inward clearing advice so this is h i c t m o is the command for entering this so click on go this screen appears we have to add each and every instrument keep on adding till all the instruments are added you don't have to submit remember this a zone date it will be today's date zone code will automatically populate here on searcher also click on go this screen appears here add zone code right click on go here then you have to enter each and every instrument every check belongs to a particular account of our bank of our customer we have to enter that account id 
and the amount mentioned in the check in the first half of the screen. After that, there is an instrument detailed tab here. So in live videos, I'll be sharing with all of you this. So you have to enter the check number carving yes. Now I'll explain this why carving is yes is because we have received, let's say I am having a balance of rupees 2 lakhs in my account and I have issued a check of rupees, let's say 50,000 to any customer of different bank. He presents that check to my bank for clearance. And I am having a balance of two lakhs, and I try to withdraw at least one lakh twenty-five thousand, one lakh seventy-five thousand. So I may withdraw. Meanwhile, that check is also presented in clearing for inward. So it will have to be returned. So as soon as I enter that instrument in HICTMO, the amount is carved. Means I cannot withdraw this before. So otherwise, any there will be a problem if customer withdraws that amount the check was entered the balance was there but in between customer withdrew the account so that fell short and check will have to be returned but since this process is completed we marketed carve we carve 50000 from my account right so that i can i can only withdraw 1 lakh 50,000 from my own account though the balance is 2 lakhs here and I have given a check of 50,000 here. Now if my check is returned due to any reason a difference in signatures or, or a difference in balances this carving has to be done as no. When the balance is there it is yes by default when the check is entered in the system. In case balance is not there a check has to be returned maybe due to my signature difference maybe due to some insufficient balance. When I mark a returning HICTMO, I have to make this Y2 no here. Remember this instrument type, check, date, and click on add. Keep on adding instruments. I'll show you screenshots. When I'll be showing you live, it'll be more easier for all of you, right? So here it is. Keep on adding. Left hand side, you can see here. Let's say there are 50 instruments. So you have to add these 50 instruments. So whatever you are adding here, writing here will appear here on the first, second, third, fourth till the 50 checks are entered here. You can see account ID, instrument number, amount, pay, transaction code, if it is savings or current, instrument type, check, carving, yes, reject, no. When we reject, carving becomes no and reject becomes yes and we have to assign a reason for rejecting it. Temporary overdraft, no here, right? So account ID, it is written on the check, amount is written on the check, instrument number is there, date is there, right, carve is yes. We are carving means we are reserving that much balance. I customer cannot withdraw as soon as I have entered this check into HICTMO, right, remember this. Temporary overdraft, no. In case of any customer request, we can give it as why. That much overdraft shall be created, but that is decided by the appropriate authority under proper sanction right rejection not reject remember this this is very important carve yes reject no when check is entered in inward clearing and if you want to return this check carve has to be this radio tab button has to be from yes to no converted to no here and reject reason yes inward clearing reject then there is a tab here we have to Click on that. We have to assign from which bank we received it. We have to assign the reason why we are rejecting it. Insufficient balance, signature difference, whatever it is, right? Instrument date is there. This is there. We keep on adding these instruments, right? Don't submit, right? So this is how we keep on doing it. We keep on adding. First instrument is added. Now the second instrument shall be added. So we can go on submitting this. This is how instruments are entered in the system here right okay so friends after entering all the instruments we have to run a validation run to see that whether sufficient balance is available or not whether carving has been done or not a report is generated all the instruments are checked individually that sufficient balance is there of course signature has to be verified there right so this is how we run a validation. The function shall be V. HMICZ 
with which command we open the zone with the same command we have to run the validation report here right so system displays inquiry on maintain invert clearing zone criteria screen right click on go here validation run enter the zone date zone code click on go here you get this validation run and a report is generated through hpr we generate that report right maintain inward clearing zone system runs a batch process and generate a report which can be viewed through using hpr if there's any short balance then we have to reject that check so batch program successfully invoked this is hpr menu options after running we get this already carved instrument rejected we have rejected this the next video i'll show you how to reject an instrument so this is carved means balance is there signature is okay this is rejected due to any reason right so this has to be done validation then after then we post to the zone and all the instruments are posted in the respective accounts and 50,000 will be debited actually debited in my account after carving is done here so this is how we do it right so every time a modification of large instrument is done in the zone validation run activity has to be performed so after rejecting again we have to run a validation report we have to generate this report and we have to verify that all is okay actually with seeing all the individual checks that sufficient balance is available or not right and this is validation run here so after instruments have been lost checks have been entered into the system with the menu option HICTMO this has the same option has to be used for verification also right so we type the verifier has to type this and there is also mass verification also after validation run a verifying officer can also run a mass verification if he has verified the signatures and sufficient balance is there so we call it htv here hictmo by entering the same menu option shortcut field click on go verify zone date zone code click on go here right same process same screen here system displays a list of checks lodged into the zone here right so you can verify any instruments we reject from here we type the instrument number all the details shall be populated what we had entered as a maker here right so authorizer to check each record to verify correctness of the data verifier can also check signatures by click on signature icons use up and down arrow to navigate system displays the result screen right so this is suppose we are here and if you bring the down cursor it will appear here so we can verify from this cursor signatures of all the instruments so we just have to scroll the cursor move up and down right and finally we submit after verifying all these instruments so here it is showing three it can be 100 200 300 so bus just by arrow down arrow up you can see the balance you can see the balance from details here this one this is the for view details if balance is short this is signature icon they have to verify from here as a verifying officer here right so instruments are verified successfully this is how the process so we open the zone we enter the number of instruments the number of amount in the advice then we entered each and every check now we verified after that we suspend the zone right after ensuring there is no returning and we close the zone each day so this is how inward clearing is done for suspending and uh, closing hmicz same command which would be open the zone simply function has to be changed and just submit the process shall be over right i hope this is of use to you right